video we will learn how to install glassfish to do this at first we uh, you have to open eclipse and then click on server tab to create a server at first you have to click here no servers are available so we click here here you will see there is no options for glassfish that means we need to download additional servers from this link so click on download additional server adapters now you will see some servers are downloading here and you will see the glassfish server tools uh, just click here and wait a few more moments and then click next and click I accept the terms of the license agreement and then click finish uh, install extension and uh, here you will find a message support for glassfish tools will now be downloaded and installed you will be prompt to restart once the installation is complete so click on ok You need to restart your release. Uh, would you like to restart now? Click on yes. Now the Eclipse will be restarted very soon. Just wait. Now you will see that still there is no glass server. That means it is still we could not uh, still finish the server configuration. So again, we need to click here, and now you will find the Glassfish option with two types of server: Glassfish 3.1 and Glassfish 4.0. Uh, just install the latest version, uh, Glassfish 4.0. Just select this and then click on next button. Now you will find a message Glassfish server runtime requires full JDK instead of JRE. Uh, so we need to install JRE preference. Just click here and click on add and choose a standard VM and click next and choose the JRE home by clicking the free button and go to my computer and the default java install location program files then java then jdk and click on ok and then click finish and choose the newly added install jre and then click on ok and Choose the location where the Glassfish server year 2 will be installed. So click on browse then downloads and then we create a new folder. We name it glassfish fish and then click on OK and click on the install server button. Now it will install the Glassfish server from the website and click on I accept the terms of the license agreement and then click finish. You see that it is it will uh, it is downloading here and it will be downloaded into the location of Glassfish. and now click on next 
and then click on finish now you will see the graspy server link here and it will be located under servers panel to start this graspy server just right click here and then click on start and it will be started within very shortly if everything is okay then you will find some message in the console and there will be a green arrow here just check the console yes that's all uh, you will see this message is started and synchronized and with a small green arrow and in the console you will find that this starts successfully this type of message and if you if the server uh, is not is started su uh, successfully then you will find some error message here and that's all you can easily configure the glitch dash server